Hey everybody, I want to show you how you can get more value out of your Oculus Quest 2 headset by getting free games with the SideQuest app. It's really easy to do, it's a one-time setup thing, and then you have access to a ton of free games. And even if you already know about the SideQuest app, you may not be aware of this new feature where you can access the app directly into the headset now. So it's a one-time setup thing on your computer, and then you can just download free apps directly on the headset. So I'll leave a timestamp in the video, and you can skip directly to that. But if you're relatively new to VR and you don't know how to do this, then hopefully I can get you up to speed relatively fast. First, we'll start by opening up Google Chrome or whichever browser you want. I'm going to guess mode. And I'm just going to type in SideQuest. So it will bring you to SideQuestVR.com. I'm going to click on Download SideQuest. So we'll click there. Here we have the Download SideQuest page. You have the Easy Installer or the Advanced Installer where you can use Windows, Mac, or Linux. There's also a mobile version on Google Play, so even if you have an Android phone or tablet, you can still use SideQuest with that device. So really, the only way you can't get access to SideQuest is if you only have an iPhone or iPad. But let's go ahead and download the Advanced Installer for Windows. And once it's finished downloading, we'll double click on that to run the executable. We'll say choose install for anyone on this computer, click next, click yes, install. All right, we'll finish and run SideQuest. All right, so now we have SideQuest running. It's as easy as that. And there's a few more steps that we have to do. And as you can see, SideQuest here is a library of a bunch of games that range from demos to free games. All of this which is not accessed on the Meta Store on the headset itself. So there's a lot more options out there for VR than what you can get with just the headset. But you can still use it on the Quest. All right, the next thing we want to do is go into the headset itself. Okay, there we go. So, now we want to take a USB-C and plug it into the headset. Once we plug that in, we should get this Enable Oculus Link. This will let us link it up to the computer and put files on it. So, let's click Enable there. And now here we are in the Oculus PC version view. So, once we're in the PC mode, you would think that we should be able to come up here and connect to the headset through SideQuest. Well, not quite yet. First we have to switch over to the phone app. So search for your nearby devices and found my Quest 2. Scroll down the headset settings and we'll go into developer mode. Putting into developer mode is gonna allow us to sideload apps onto the headset. So now that we did that, we'll get out of there. And we'll take the headset back. And let's actually turn it off and turn it back on. All right, so now that we're in developer mode, we'll go back into the headset and replug it in. So we'll go back into the Oculus Link. Now we're back in PC mode. And now that we have developer mode on, you can see that here in SideQuest, now we have a green dot here saying that's identified a device. Up here in the top right, there's a bunch of icons here. But right here, you can see currently installed apps. So if I click on that, I can see everything I have installed on my headset right now. If I go over to here, it says it's running zero task. And what I can do is if I have an APK file or an Android package kit, just like here I have my ModMask demo, I can take it, I can drag it onto here, into the SideQuest window. It'll say that it's installing the APK, and so the APK installed OK. After that, I can go back into the headset here. Okay, so back into the headset, we can go back and disable the Oculus Link, just go back right to the Quest, not the PC version of Quest. And then we can go to apps and over here there's all we can go to unknown sources and here you can see the file mod masks i can click on that and now as you can see i added a custom file to my oculus headset and that works for any apk file so that one i already had on my desktop however if we go here on the sidequest app we can download many apks from here as well or sideload them directly from a direct connection onto the headset. So if you want to be able to use SideQuest on your headset itself, you do need to sign up. Okay, and once you have an account made, you have access to all of these games here. So let's go to this Attack on Quest for free. As you can see, I have my headset linked up already. Go ahead and download the app. In parentheses, it says Sideload. Running one task, so we're downloading the APK. 
so this app will download and install the APK just like that. If we go back into the headset, if we go back to our unknown sources, you can see now we have Attack on Quest here alongside our mod mask. That one was just all installed using the app. There was no drag and drop in the APK files. It all just downloaded and installed from the app onto the computer and it side loaded with the headset plugged in. Okay, so if you don't want to hook up your headset to your computer each and every time to install a game just like that, they now have a beta for the easy installer. So let's go back to the SideQuest page and we'll download the easy installer for Windows. So once that's finished, I'll run that. And so here's the window for the SideQuest easy installer. Here's the install SideQuest in your headset. So I'll go ahead and click that. And it says that SideQuest installed to the headset. Easy as that. Go back in the headset, but this time I'm going to unplug it. Okay, now we're back in the headset. So let's go back into our unknown sources. As you can see, we have Mod Mask, we have Attack on Quest, and now we have Side Quest itself. So we'll go ahead and click on that. It now tells us here to go to sdq.st slash link. So let's go ahead and go to sdq.st slash link. I'll go ahead and sign in. And then we'll enter this six digit code to make the connection. And it says, are you sure you want to link this app? I'll click down here, link app. Okay, cool. And now that we have that linked, now I can just go into my unknown sources and run SideQuest right here in the headset, not connected to my PC at all. So let's check out Physics Playground here. You see, this is going to download the app from itch and we'll download the Android file from quest. Go ahead and click download. It's downloading the APK for your security. Your phone is not allowed to install unknown apps from this source. Let's go to settings, allow from the source, go back. And we'll try it one more time. You want to install this application click install and you see it says that it installed it successfully we'll go back to our apps and here's physics playground so for those of you who are new to vr thank you for watching i hope you learned something from this or if you already have been using sidequest but only on the pc version now you can install it directly from your headset all cool ways of doing it so i hope this video is helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe thank you and i'll see you next time